ladies and gentlemen, 8 o'clock central. What time is it in New Zealand? I don't know. This is sh virtual show number 57. 57 shows. In those 57 shows, I have played 413 different songs. Total songs played in those 56 shows up till now, 1,218. This is 1,219 right here. And I told a lie over the weekend in Green Bay. I said this was a true story. It's not. Because I fell in love with the hostess at the Olive Garden. When she said, this way, please. I followed her to a table in the back of that. I fell down on my knees. Infatuation, humiliation. To me, that's nothing new. Remember, I fell in love with, I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. Remember, I fell in love with, I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. And that's a dangerous thing to do. It's scary and nerve-wracking, too. You tore my whole world apart. Love is not for the faint of heart. Fell in love with the teller at the credit union. Oh, did I fall? She acted like she wouldn't mind. Depression to depression. To me, that's nothing new. Remember, I fell in love with. I fell in love with. I fell in love with you. Remember, I fell in love with. I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. And that's a dangerous thing to do. It's scary and nerve-wracking, too. You tore my whole world apart. Love is not for the faint of heart. Situation, humiliation, to me that's nothing new. From obsession to depression, that's something I've been through. Desolation, desperation, those are familiar too. Remember, I fell in love with, I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. Remember, I fell in love with. I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. Remember, I fell in love with, I fell in love with, I fell in love with you. I fell in love with you. I fell in love with you. Yeah. Love is not for the faint of heart. Welcome to show number 57. Quite a sucky week here in the Midwest and all over the world. Yeah, I wrote a song when I was 22 years old, recorded it for a band I had called Yipes. Still applies to today, all these like 10 years later. So Doug Anderson in California, Rod Wilhelm in Colorado. now it's not the same the world's at war and we're at play let's try and wish the world away or scare but i don't know why you have to be we talk and talk and talk some more what will we do in case of war we'll fight the reds go underground and when we're done we'll hang around you're scared but i don't know why you have to be because i don't care if the a-bomb falls i'm on my if mr putin calls it's 
it's okay cause it all will be that way in spite of me and I don't care if the A-bombs drop I won't mind if the jukebox stops it's okay if they take control we've still got rush and roll that part. Hey, hey, the Reds are here. The Reds are there. The commies are cool. The commies are square. From Siberia to Leningrad. The vodka's good, but their aim is bad. You're scared. But I don't know why you have to be Cause I don't care if the A-bomb falls I won't mind if Mr. Putin calls It's okay cause it all will be that way in spite of me and I don't care if the A-bombs drop I won't mind if the jukebox stops it's okay if they take control, we've still got a rush and roll. And I don't care if the A-bombs burst, I won't mind if they get here first. It's okay if they got no soul, we've still got a rush and roll. Goose jump, rush and roll. Fresh jump, rush and roll. Hey, Vladimir! to tyrants everywhere, ladies and gentlemen. And to think there's people in this country who'd like a leader just like that. Sucky week, that's why tonight's show is gonna be so damn uplifting, you will not believe it. That's right, Michael Hanlon. That's right, Michael Hanlon, we are gonna, we are gonna affirm our happiness. Listen. Every morning when I look into the mirror I see living proof Of all my wasted years I sing this little song It helps me to be strong And all my suicidal feelings drift away Let me hear you say, I, I am wonderful. I'm so wonderful. I'm a breathtaking view, a dream that's come true. It's true. I am wonderful. I'm wondering if right now anyone feels quite as wonderful as I do. Standing in my living room, a hip replacement behind me, ready to drink. Two or three friends. Oh, we don't have to pretend anymore. There's like 12 people in this room right now. Yes, it's not always like this, no. Sometimes when I go to work, I just want to die. Cause it's boring. Sometimes I don't know why Why I go on with this grind Why I haven't lost my mind Why I just don't buy a little airplane and fly Let me hear you say I am wonderful I'm so wonderful, I'm spectacular, I'm marvelous, and I'm cool, I am wonderful, merely wonderful, I'm the 4th of July, oh I don't 
open sky of blue. I am wonderful. I'm the nearest thing to perfection that mankind has ever known. I'm the top of the food chain. If they made a movie of my life, I'd be played by uh, the guy who's Spider-Man. The newest one. Tom, you know, Tom Holland. Oh, yes, I. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Am. Michael Hanlon. Wonderful. Michael and Shannon Hammersburg from Altoona, Wisconsin. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. Come on over and do God knows what to you. Even though I on occasion have dropped everything, gone on over and done God knows what to you. You can't assume that I'll always be here. I've got friends, I've got hobbies, I've got a career. You can't just call and expect me to drop favorite. You can't just call and expect me to drop favorite. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. Oh, yes, you can. I will sleep with you, but I won't like it. I will eat your food. Just one helping. I'll read your magazines, I'll watch your flat TV, I'll make long distance calls, international, international, eh? But you can't just call and expect me to drop everything, come on over and do God knows what to you. Even though I on occasion have dropped everything, gone on over, done God knows what to you. You can't assume that I'll always be here. I've got friends, I've got hobbies, I've got a career. You can't just call and expect me to drop every. You can't just call and expect me to drop every. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. Oh yes you can. 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 Acapella for Michael and Shannon. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. Come on over and do. Even though I on occasion have dropped everything, come on over and. You can't assume that I'll always be here. I've got friends, I've got hobbies, I've got a career. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. You can't just. You can't just call and expect me to drop everything. Oh, yes, you can. 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 That was the best version of that song ever performed. Who do we have as our crack staff on this show, number 57? As usual, par usual. Manning the soundboard. Let's hear for Mr. Pipe Jim Schaffelberger. Pipe Jim Schaffelberger, long last name. Chris Hyden is watching in, Me watching in Mexico. Hola, Chris. Hola. Oh, thank you. The ever handsome. Kevin Hansen on camera. A lot of requests for songs that I play with Kevin tonight. There's, he's going to be up here half the time. And tonight, where is she? Where did, was she? Is she gone? Oh, back again. She wasn't here last month or last time we did this. The mistress of alcohol. 
who was a little upset that I was handing out titles at the last show? And the Mrs. of Alcohol, Bethany, let's hear for her right now. Come on. And Oh, what the hell is that? A Manhattan? It was good. And filling in Brian Murphy, whose knee has just been replaced, is not here. So perform tonight, portraying Brian Murphy. Murphy. You can call him Murph. Limp up here, Murph. Here's uh, the man portraying Murph tonight is Joe Hip. Let's hear Oak Creek's finest, Joe Hip. Oh, Mark, thank you, Mark. So, Joe, you will be taking over all of Murph's duties, which are none. <laughs> so just drink. <laughs> but I do have a song for Joe's wife, Melissa. I don't care about Joe that much. Everyone knows I love the Melissa. This is kind of old news, but she likes this song, so I'm playing it for her, okay? Meet the new variant that everybody's getting. Uh-oh, Omicron. People are amazed at how rapidly it's spreading. Uh-oh, Omicron. It's not as bad as Delta, although they are related. You probably won't die if you're fully vaccinated. Meet the new variant that's coming to town. What? Uh-oh, Omicron. Omicron, Omicron, uh uh, Omicron, 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 uh uh, Omicron, 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 uh uh, Omicron, Omicron. Wait. Well, the doctors are exhausted and their patients getting hostile. Uh oh, Omicron. I got a foot long swab sticking up my nostril. Uh oh, Omicron. Everybody's sick all over Wisconsin. Even God has got it. I'm sorry, Ron Johnson. So meet the new variant that's coming to town. What? Looks like we're in a COVID lull right now. Maybe it's over. We can hope. That's why I'm revisiting this song all week. Yeah, this is one that I wrote in the middle of the pandemic. Always uplifting, always optimistic. That's me. I am glass half full all the way. I like this song, too. Listen. It's been a dark and dismal year, but things are gay. We've been smiling through the tears. Things are getting better. The witch is dead. The monster's gone. And things are getting better. It's time to face a brand new dawn. Cause things are getting better now. Things are getting better than they ever were before. Peace and love and happiness wait right outside your door. So put a smile upon your face, cause things are getting better. No time to lose, no time to waste, cause things are getting better now. I know you're sick, I know you're tired, but things are getting better. Your car smashed up, your house on fire, but things are getting better. The glow of youth, it fades so fast, but things are getting better. There might be hope for us at last, cause things are getting better now. Things are getting better, cause they can't get any worse. Take advantage of this time before the bubble bursts and put a smile upon your face.
Christ, cause things are getting better now. are getting better than they ever right outside your door so put a smile upon your face cause things are getting better no time to lose no time to waste cause things are getting getting better now they're getting better now Bruce and Nancy shower out there in Arizona Bruce and Nancy requested about 7,000 songs this week I'll do one for Nancy definitely I don't know how I don't know how Bruce is doing in that room. It will be spring in Wisconsin. She said, I think it's time for some spring cleaning. And threw all my belongings on the lawn. And she said, I'd like to do some home improvement. And by summertime, I was gone. You get, you get it? She's trying to do some home improvements. And, okay. So there goes Bruce, right? She said, why do I put up with this nonsense? I sense my days were numbered before long. Then she said, I'd like to do some spring cleaning. And by summertime, I was gone. Is this a gyro or a gyro? I'm not Greek. How should I know? But this is what I've eaten every night this week. I might be becoming Greek. She said, I think it's time for some spring cleaning. And threw all my belongings on the lawn. Then she said, I'd like to do some home improvements. And by summertime, Bruce was gone. You're a drunk. You're a wino. That's what she said. How should I know? Every night I drink to try to ease the pain. Here's one more sad refrain. She said, I think it's time for some spring cleaning. And threw all my belongings on the lawn. Then she said, I'd like to do some home improvement. And by summertime, I was gone. By summertime, I was gone. Summertime, I was gone. You want to know what I've been doing since you left me with a broken heart. I get the feeling that you're hoping I'm still miserable, still torn apart. You want to know what I've been up to since you walked out and turned me upside down. Well, I won't lie to you. Well, I've been going out 
having fun, making friends, screw you. Going places, running wild, meeting people, it's true. Doing things I couldn't do, all those years I spent with you. Never thought forgetting you would be so easy. Chad Reddy, celebrating the six years since he's been divorced. <laughs> with a little screw you for Chad. And here's something odd. Wendy Wasmer is celebrating her birthday by requesting screw you. Because you only come back when you want to make sure that you're still in control. Now and then you have to let me know that you own my heart and soul. You don't care what I've been doing since you left me, but I'll tell you anyway. And I won't lie to you. Well, I've been going out, having fun, making friends, screw you. Going places, running wild, meeting people, it's true. One thing you could do for me, get out of my memory. I never thought that being free would feel so joyful. So this is how the whole thing ends. You say we can still be friends. Oh, happy birthday, Wendy. I don't believe I've ever heard such utter bullshit. Well, I've been going out, having fun, making friends. Joe! Going places, running wild, meeting people, screw you. Going out, getting drunk at Wendy Wasmer's birthday party, screw you. Going out, Tinder, screw you. Going out, having fun, making friends, screw you. Whoa! Uh, thank you, Chad. Thank you, Wendy. You know, and thank you, people who uh, donated in the last show. That includes Cheddar from Iowa, Chad. Yes, Chad, we will be playing in Iowa tomorrow night. What's the town? Gutenberg, Iowa, tomorrow night at the Lakeside Ballroom. What time? 8 p.m. So, Ch Chad, I expect to see you sneaking in the window there. <laughs> Monica Hall out there in... Lake Mills, wherever the hell you live now. Oh, April. April Spurk in Las Vegas, Nevada. Being the technological genius that I am, I deleted the email you sent me. All your book recommendations. I'll just get your regular number from Pipe Jim, and I'll talk to you that way. Still miss you, though, April. Susan Klingman, thank you. Karen Reiner was not watching the show from Whitefish Bay. She's watching it later because she's at the Birkebiner. That's some sort of dog sled, I don't know, some drinking event. Linda Lehman, thank you. Stephen Peggy Brenner of Economy Walk, thank you for donating. Dave Hallbrooks said he was listening to my entire catalog from A to Z. It's kind of like the Beatles channel. <laughs> Tim and Susan Griffin from Asheville, North Carolina. You know I love Asheville, and I know Tim and Susan, too. Paul, Paul Jones, I didn't hear from Paul Jones this week, maybe... Paul's in New Orleans, so he's not watching this anyway. Yeah, Paul. Yeah, thanks, Paul. Bridget Cross, thank you for donating. Derek Mosier, thanks for the nice note. You know I love him. Douglas Johnson, thank you. Rebecca Winsell, thank you. And Sean and Danny Closey, uh, I'm doing uplifting songs tonight, and the two you requested are about a dystopian future. And I can do like a sample of each request for you, but I could not learn the whole song. We were standing by the water, by the river's edge. Every man, every woman, every child. By the river's edge. And the morning was as still as a dead man. Not a word was said. When I do my dystopian future show, I will be sure to play the whole song for you, Sean. You're moving to the tropics anyway, so you're happy. 
the empty buildings, I cannot find a copy of that anywhere. So I'm sure Pipe has it on a CD somewhere. Oh, and happy birthday to Annika. Via Gooch, Annika. I want you to want me. Keith Frank, happy birthday. Angela Salmon, happy birthday. And Mr. I don't have any knees that I was born with, Brian Murphy. Happy birthday, Murph. Is, I don't know if it's today. It's coming up. We, we can never remember. Even though I've known you for half my life, I don't ever remember your birthday. But you know who else's birthday it is tonight? And who, it, it, most importantly, I have to say, Dan Poe. Nikki, Nikki requested that I do a song for Dan's birthday. Now, Dan, if you've ever seen the official Sex and Beer video that's actually so much better than all my other videos, that's the one Dan directed and filmed. Now, Dan, Nikki gave me uh, some choices, but uh, I think I'm going to do this one for Dan. Happy birthday, Dan. in Kansas on the lone prairie dreaming of the lights of Paris aren't we mon cherie we'll probably end up in Wisconsin drinking lots of beer writing postcards to our friends that say wish you were here you and I are so in love no matter what they say need is just a dream away but if we ever cross the ocean I hope the boat don't sink I'll make sure the captain only has a couple drinks it's hard Dan double time So in love, no matter what they say, everything we'll ever need is just a dream away. Now, someday we'll be up in heaven having brunch with God. We'll be so surprised to learn his real name is Todd. Todd, won't you buy me a Mercedes Benz? Todd, are you watching over me and my friends? Todd, are you listening to all my prayers? Todd, damn it! Someday we'll be up in heaven having brunch with God. We'll be so surprised to learn his real name is yeah. ah. Happy birthday, Dan. Hope someday you get to have brunch with God as well. Elise Gordels, or, or, or Elise Gordels. Angela Van Ginkle. I got your request. I have always been responsible. I've always had a sense of obligation to God and the fly, to mom and apple pie. So I, I don't know what's come over me. Don't know wherein lies this insanity, but I have to live. At least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Hey, hey. Tonight, sing it. I want to do something dumb. I, 
I feel like I've been suffocating, hesitating, waiting for a moment when I could even try to flap my weary arms and fly. I, I know I'm Mr. Family, Mr. House, the dog and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. So tonight, I want to ruin my life. I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. Something dumb, and I don't care. So I won't care what happens when you close that door. I don't care what happens to me anymore. Anymore. La 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 Good evening, Gutenberg Iowa! Mr. Family, Mr. House, the dog and the Jeep Cherokee, but I have to live at least once before I die. Uh, Elise, oh, uh, Angela, please join me because tonight, what? I want to throw it all away in a spectacular way. You're coming with me! I don't know what you do when your spare time, but I like to watch English television shows. compare notes with my friend Sharon in Chicago, who also likes to watch English television shows. Sometimes I get Joe Hip in the loop on the English television shows. Now, a few years ago, I wrote a song about going to England. Well, that was recorded with my band. This is my new one. My baby's moving to England. brand new so I cannot remember the lyrics at all. I'll get him, I'll get him, hold on. Practice this all week. Just have a brain freeze. I told Timmy I would have a brain freeze. Did I not predict this? That's in the UK. She's kind of bored in Milwaukee. That's in the US of A. It looks so nice in the movies. Or so she said. The one with Julia Roberts. Hot Fuzz and Shaun of the Dead. I won't try to change her mind, I'll stay behind because Someday she might come back to me and I'll be here when she does My 
baby's moving to England Where everything's so old I think she wants to hang out with a Spy who came in from the coast I don't get the attraction She doesn't even like tea Maybe she thinks that it's still like Sense and sensibility Try to change her mind, I'll stay behind because someday she might come back to me and I'll be here when she does. Because, oh, you know, I love that woman so. When she said goodbye, it really made me want to die. Just as I feared Cause in my humble opinion Most Europeans are weird But look at me, I'm no better And that's why she's gone Maybe I'll write her a letter But then I probably won't Yeah but Someday she might come back me and I'll be there when she does. So I won't try to change her mind. I'll be behind because I won't try to change her mind. I'll stay behind because someday she might come back to me and I'll be here when she does. Because my baby's moving to England. Baby's moving to England. My baby's moving to England. Now you can move in with me. Thank you. It's my brand new song. My baby's moving to England. Hashtag you can move in with me now. Hey, you know who should get up here right now? You know who should start doing some jamming. E H K H. The ever handsome Kevin Hansen's gonna come up here and strap on that that guitar. Oh. Meanwhile, I'll have a little drink of uh, my hip replacement. Ah, I just can't muster a drinking word this week. Just too much depressing shit happening in the world. How about depressing shit? No, I'm trying to be uplifting. Hey, Kevin, you know a song called "My Baby's Moving to England"? <laughs> Jin G. I need this one. Yeah, I wrote that when I was Rory Slick. You know who had a bad week? Peggy Hurley. Peggy Hurley had a bad week, and Mark is nice enough to, to request a song for Peggy. All about McGuanago, Wisconsin. Rolling down high low drive, pedal to the metal in my old car. Rolling down high low drive, looking for wherever the good times are. Tank full, top down, I'm glad to be alive. I can't stop now, I'm rolling down high low drive. Oh. Kevin, you have not lost. You haven't, you haven't lost a step. In the two weeks since I've seen you. <laughs> Second verse. Rolling down high low drive. Deep in the belly of a Saturday night. Rolling down high low drive. Heading toward the bright city lights. Up to Berlin. All you husbands hide your wives. Tonight I'm buzzing up and down high low drive. Hi, 
love. I love. Would you rise? It feels so good to be alive. On high low You know, it feels like we're just riding, driving in the car, over hills, into valleys. No, it feels like we're, it feels like we're rolling down high-low drive, dressed to the nines in my Sunday suit, rolling down high-low drive, looking for some drugs and a prostitute. Oh, where are they? Where are they? Oh, I'm just kidding you. I'm not that kind of guy. All I want to do is roll up and down high low drive here we go high low high low high low to ride it feels so good to be alive it feels so good to be alive it feels so good to be alive on high low drive on high low drive high low drive high low drive Guess what, everybody? Kate Bohm is 12 years old. She thinks this is an hysterical song. Yeah. yeah. Tiny people with enormous heads are haunting my dreams in the night. I know they're hiding underneath my bed so it won't turn out the light. Pictures in the magazines and the movies and on TV. Tiny people with enormous heads are scaring the crap out of me. Oh my God, Kate. I mean, Kate Bohm. Second verse is exactly the same. Tiny people with enormous heads are haunting my dreams in the night. Though they're hiding underneath my bed So it won't turn out the light I see their pictures in the magazines In the movies and on TV Tiny people with enormous heads Are scaring the crap out of me There's a tiny person living down my street With a head like a medicine ball He's a politician, no Anchor man, I'm not real sure at all. He's got bulging eyes and puffy cheeks, tiny little legs and tiny little feet and hands. Do you understand? That is one of those tiny people with enormous heads. They're haunting my dreams in the night. I know they're hiding underneath my bed, so I won't turn out the light. I see their pictures in the magazines and the movies and on TV. Tiny people with enormous heads are scaring the crap out of me. Enormous people with tiny heads are coming after you and me. Across the countryside, eating everything they see. They're supersizing, and when they get full, they wash the tiny people large everywhere. Enormous people with tiny heads are scaring the bejesus out of me. Tiny people with enormous heads are haunting my dreams in the night. I know they're hiding underneath my bed. So I won't turn out the light. See their pictures in the magazines, in the movies, and on TV. Tiny people with enormous heads are scaring the crap out of me. Tiny 
Tiny people with enormous heads are scaring the crap out of me. Tiny people with enormous heads are scaring the crap out of me. Tiny people with huge heads. Oh. Ever handsome. He's not done yet. No, he's not done yet. I'm going to put this one down. Somebody I didn't write down who requested that I play the uh, electric guitar. I didn't request that. Oh. But I'm going to do it. Okay, who requested this song? So many people. Cindy Kearney on her birthday requested this song. Car oh, Carrie Bondi requested this song. Paula Schultz requested this song. Who knows what the hell's going on out there? You know, who knows? I'm nude. You're nude. We're gonna have a nude party. I'm nude. You're nude. We're gonna have a nude party. Mom's nude, dad's nude, they're playing bridge with their nude neighbors. Grandma's nude, grandpa's nude, they're eating whipped cream, pop rocks, and lifesavers. And they're gonna have a nude party. The baby looks so cute in her birthday suit. We'll dance till dawn with nothing on. We're gonna have a nude party. Till dawn with nothing on. We're gonna have a nude party. I'll call you babe. You call me dude. What kind of party is that? Yes, I'll call you babe. You call me dude. What kind of party is that? And good news. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, the ever handsome Kevin Hansen on rhythm guitar.
Last time I saw Laura Tucker, she was drunk. But Laura Tucker is one of the best drunk people in the entire world. I sang to Dan before. Dan, you sometimes the designated driver. Laura, you don't know this. How could you know this? This is one of my favorite songs that I ever wrote. But it's not one that I play very often, but when you request it, you got it. In your eyes, there's the glint of insanity. And your mouth is a font of profanity. You don't have any faith in humanity. All oh, that's true. But the reason I'm thinking of rolling on while I'm acting so woefully woebegone, you deny you and I got it going on, but we do. I like you. You like me, and it's obvious to see. No more lying, wasting time. No more dicking around. I like you, you like me, and it's elementary. No more lying, wasting time. No more dicking around. We've been friends for it seems like a century. I was hoping for much more eventually. Only sometimes you act like we're enemies. Don't know why. Cause the signals I send should be plain to you. And my words shouldn't sound so insane to you. I don't know how to explain to you, but I'll try. It's obvious to see No more lying No more crying No more dicking around I like you You like me And that's reality No more lying No more crying No more dicking around No more lying No more crying No more dicking around signals I send should be plain to you, and my words shouldn't sound so insane to you. I don't know how to explain to you, but I'll try. I like you, you like me, and it's obvious to see. No more lying, no denying, no more digging around. I like you, you like me. That's reality. No more lying, no denying, no more taking around. No more lying, no denying, no more taking around. No more lying, no denying, no more taking around. I don't play this song in the off season. But ladies and gentlemen, Elliot Falk is seven years old. Elliot Falk is Brian Murphy's new best friend. Because I played Elliot's dad's ukulele in the last virtual show. You guys in the living room, you know what to do when I when I play. Yeah, blood curdling screams all around. There's a rat on the stairs of Auntie Purple's house. There's 100 dead canaries at Auntie Purple's house. There's a head in the stove that she picked up off the road. There's a lot to see at Auntie Purple's house. (sighs) 
There's a noose in the attic of Auntie Purple's house, and you'll always feel ecstatic at Auntie Purple's house. She will serve little pies filled with real human eyes. There's a lot to see at Auntie Purple's house. And her garden, it grows so beautifully. But only Auntie Purple knows what's buried in the flower bed. Uncle Red. <laughs> There's big black pots without lids. At Auntie Purple's house and Egyptian pyramid. At Auntie Purple's house, there's a cat from Siam sleeping in a pentagram. There's a lot to see at Auntie Purple's house. Where do wobbling goblins go? How about Edgar Allan Poe? There's a ghost and a ghoul living in the vestibule. There's a lot to see at Auntie Purple's house. It's unusual at Auntie Purple's house. So I never go to Auntie Purple's house. Ah! Oh. Wow. And now, a song that should not follow a request by a seven-year-old. Adam Schleicher. I should not put this after a request for a seven-year-old, but I did. I could worry myself to distraction. I could take a prescription drug. When it comes to your satisfaction, I should just lie back and shrug. I could practice and never be perfect. I could struggle and toil to no end. I could be gentle and sweet, but I could never compete with your electronic friend. I could be gentle and sweet, but I could never compete with your electronic friend. Buzz, buzz, buzz. It isn't because I'm unwilling to try. Buzz, buzz, buzz. I never was an unconfident guy. But I could practice and never be perfect. I could struggle and toil to no end. I could be gentle and sweet, but I could never compete with your electronic friend. I could walk on thin air, but I could never compare to your electronic friend. Do everything that I could, but I cannot be as good as your electronic friend. So will you take to bed when the batteries are dead and your electronic friend? No, no, there's no drinking word. Drink at your leisure. Just drink a, do whatever you want. Just drink. I'm going to finish this one, and I will pour another one. Ah. Now, 
Now I've covered all the requests. Uh, no, I have more requests. Don't get me wrong. The show is not, not over by a long time. Pam and Corey. Corey from Clark Graphics. I believe, no, no, this is not your request. I'm so sorry. I messed, I messed up my order. I had to change the order a little bit. This is for Greg Miskak. Miscanis. This is for Greg Miscanis. Greg! Look at someone right now, gaze into their eyes and repeat after me. Give me that groovy thing. Give me that. Give me that groovy thing. Give me that groovy thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groovy thing. Don't give me your whole life story It's probably not a whole lot different than mine Don't give me every rock in the quarry There's one that gets me rocking every time Just give me that groovy thing Give me that, give me that groovy thing Give me that groovy thing Give me, give me that, give me that groovy thing Don't give me your lame excuses. Don't give me your Hail Mary beat. Don't tell me about your creative juices. There's only one thing that I really need. Just give me that groovy thing. Give me that. Give me that groovy thing. Give me that groovy thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groovy thing. That groovy thing. Give me that groovy thing. Give me that. Give me that groovy thing. Uh. Give me that groovy thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groovy thing. I don't want to be a big disappointment like I've been so many times before. I don't want to be the fly in your ointment, and you won't have to worry anymore. Just give me that groovy thing. Give me that. Give me that groovy thing. Give me that groovy thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groovy thing. That groovy thing. That groovy thing. That groovy thing. Give me that. Groove it there. Give me that. Give me that groove it thing. Give me that groove it thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groove it thing. Oh, one more. Give me that groove it thing. Give me that. Give me that groove it thing. Give me that groove it thing. Give me, give me that. Give me that groove it thing. You're at it. Give me some money. Give me some money. Give me some. Yeah, go ahead, contribute, donate. Because I'm. This could be my last show ever. <laughs> it's not. But I just realized that Pam and Corey's request is going to be difficult because there is no, no knee Murphy here tonight. Are there any other singers? We have one singer. Where did she go? She's here. Yeah, is she here? We have one singer. But where are we gonna who are we gonna do for the third part? Let's have Deborah Handsome, Kevin Handsome try. Let's see what we got. Bring those Fabio locks up here. Everybody. 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 We got it. We got it, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Is that right? Ladies and gentlemen, oh, now portraying Brian Murphy, 
his understudy, Kevin Hansen. Let me look at those knees, Kevin. They're driving on sidewalks and pissing in gardens. They're saying, excuse me, and begging your pardon. Everybody, Everybody. Everybody. in this town is drunk. Everybody, Everybody. in this town is drunk tonight. I don't think that mic is in the monitor. Somebody screaming that mic. Somebody checking that mic. Check. Oh, there it is. <laughs> They're walking on tight ropes just like in the circus. They're screaming obscenities from cars with no purpose. Everybody. Everybody. Everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk tonight. And they're making a chorus line up and down Main Street, swaying and staggering out of control. They're spitting and swearing and laughing at everything, laughing at me and you. Everyone's drinking from bottles and cases, all different religions and all different races. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody, everybody in this town is drunk tonight. You know what I miss right now, guys? The vibrato de Murph. Oh. <laughs> everybody. I call it Murph's, I call it his Demole register. Yeah, I do. But well, wait. They're drowning their troubles. They're drowning their sorrows. They'll start up again once they wake up tomorrow. Everybody. Everybody. Everybody in this town is drunk. Everybody. Everybody. Everybody in this one more time, guys. Everybody, everybody, everybody in this town is drunk, drunk except me <laughs> and Kevin, who's portraying Brian Murphy. Kimmy's probably a little buzzed right now. Can we hear from Covalence, ladies and gentlemen? Covalence! Thank you for filling in for. Oh, I didn't think we were able to do it. I didn't think we'd be able to do it. And thanks also to Laird Lee from North Side of Madison. Thank you, Shana Shaloon, not only for donating to my show last time, but also coming to the show in Green Bay last Friday in the snow. It was a squall. There was a snow squall, and Shana came out. Stevens Patrick, always luck reading that name. Thomas Myers, no relation to Michael. Carolyn Rosewall and Marshall Roth taking care of a little baby and watching the show, I hope. Catherine Kukta. Catherine Kukta. Thank you, Catherine. Sue Dorgan. Taffy Anderson. Where did I see Taffy? Where did I see Taffy? Oh, Admirals. Admirals. Josh and Jenny down in Kenosha. Julia Bosman. Thank you so much. Cheryl Murphy. No relation to the missing Murph. Let's hear what Bruce and Sylvia Harold said. And Jan and Doug Thompson. My next virtual show is uh, March... Uh, 25th, March 25th. And you know what? Between now and March 25th, you know what drinking holiday happens? Do you know what drinking holiday happens? Yeah, it's too soon. It's too soon to do the full bore St. Patrick's show. But it's not too soon to do at least one St. Patrick's song. And I expect everyone in this room to stop yapping and taking selfies. And repeat after me. Let's get wasted. Let's get loaded. Let's go crazy. Let's drink beer. Oh, yeah. It's St. Patrick's Day. Let's get hammered. 
annihilated. Let's go wild. Drink more beer. Oh, yeah. It's St. Patrick's Day. To get intoxicated, then let's begin to go three seats for the wind. Let's get hammered, obliterated. Let's get stupid, drink green beer. Oh, yeah, it's St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day. Oh, yeah. It's St. Patrick's Day. Thank you so much. I played a jillion songs already, haven't I? I did one for Nancy Shower. Can I do one for Bruce Shower? Bruce, this is like one of my top favorite songs I ever made up. You get your hopes up, sometimes they're shattered, but in the long run, what does it matter? There's always a new day, be thankful you've got one, there's always a new way, until there's not one. So don't let your troubles get you down, don't let your struggles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. You get your heart broke. Yes, it can happen. But while they're leaving, you leave them laughing. There's always a new day. Be thankful you've got one. There's always a new way. Until there's not one. So don't let your troubles get you down. Don't let your struggles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the crazies get you down. The definite maybes get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the morons get you down. The Trout-Bamadorians get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the assholes get you down. Don't let the hassles get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the vultures get you down. The internet culture get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. And above all things, don't let the small things get you down. Don't let the small things get you down. Oh, thank you, everybody. Let's hear a pipe. Ever handsome Kevin Hansen. Joe Hip, the mistress of alcohol. Kimmy. Kimmy Unger Hansen. Change your name. Bankle chick. Cash your check. I am Pat. I'll see you on March 25th or in Iowa tomorrow night. And until then... St. Paul, in his letter to the Ephesians, said it came to me upon a midnight glare. Said I finished writing all of my gospel. Now all I seem to want is sex and bed. Mark Antony looked down on Caesar's body. He said, friends, Romans, countrymen, lend me your ear. I did not come here to praise Caesar. I came here for sex and beer. Sex and beer. 
Bear, Sex and Bear are the two things we hold dear. Sex and Bear, Sex and Bear are the things we like around here. Your heart pounds. <laughs> Might as well face it, door addicted to love. Might as well. You guys need more red lipstick. George Washington, he never crossed the Delaware. There was no midnight ride for Paul Revere. Ben Franklin never discovered electricity. He was too busy looking for sex and bear. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the things we like around here. Joe, get up here. You're singing the next chorus. Charles Dickens gave us great expectations. Shakespeare gave us Hamlet and King Lear. Dostoevsky gave us crime and punishment. Who the hell is going to give us? Sex and bear. Right. Sex and bear. Sex and bear are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear are the things we like around here. Show the heads, ladies and gentlemen. Now from the city to the suburbs to the country, from the southern to the northern hemisphere, now holding a tremendous referendum, and everybody's choosing sex and beer. Sing it, ladies. Sex and beer, sex and beer are the two things we hold dear. Sex and beer, sex and beer are the things we like around here. Mrs. of Alcohol is showing off her Mariah Carey mic skills. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I'll try it too. Because they could take away our pride and our dignity. <laughs> oh, they could use up all our blood and sweat and tears. <laughs> they could take away our names and give us numbers. 413 songs. 69. 413 more tonight, but they will never take away a sex and bear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear are the two things we hold dear. Sex and bear. Sex and bear are the things we like around here. You sing it now. One, two, three. Sex and bear. Sex and bear, sex and bear, are the things we like right Oh, yeah! You know what? I hope all these people get the hell out of my house pretty quick. Because there is new episode of Pam and Tommy on Hulu. Yeah. Oh, my God. New episode of Marvelous Mrs. Maisel. I already watched Boba Fett. Did you watch that one, Kevin? Whoa! There's so much for me to do tonight. I gotta finish that drink. But before I do, how about we do the dance one more fucking time? Here we go! Sex and bear, sex and bear are the two things we hold dear. Uh. Sex and bear, sex and bear are the things we like around here. We like sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear and sex and bear. Look out, Iowa, I'm coming. See you next time. Yeah! There is no polio anymore. Science. Shove smallpox out the door, science. But when diseases come your way, you get down on your knees and pray. My reliance is on science. And 
Your opinion's not a fact like science. In the end, it all comes back to science. Maybe you believe in ghosts and in random Facebook posts. I'm in compliance with science. Science gathers up the evidence and makes a learned conclusion. You squeeze the facts to fit some.